Hey guys, and welcome back to another train simulator video. Morning driver, heavy snow this week, meant that engineering works divert diverted all services via Northampton whilst they repaired the line via Stowhill. Nevertheless, you are in service of one uniform 27 from Northampton to crew. As far as rugby, set up your train and set the destination to crew. So, just opening doors so we can set up the cab as soon as possible. So, let's press W. Clear that. Put the headlights on. And let's put the destination as crew. As I can think, I can hear Virgin trains arriving in Overhampton. There we go, that's set as crew. We'll turn the DRA off. And we should be good to go, but let's put the wipers on. There we go. And let's get going. Let's put 390 arriving at Northampton, very nice. And we're speeding, which is not great. So we're on the West Coast Mainline South route, if you are wondering which route we're on. We're only going to be driving up towards Rugby as the Rugby to crew part of the route doesn't exist. Well, the Rugby to Stafford does exist, but it's on a different route, so... We can't drive that part, unfortunately. And we're driving on a car train, which is pretty long. So we're going to be calling at Long Buckby and Rugby, where another driver will take over the service towards crew. And it looks like it's snowing today, so... Not the best weather. So Long Buckby and crew. Let's try not to speed again. Oh, as we've got plenty of, um, what do you call it, 350s here. I like how it says London Middle in here. Even though most of these trains have the new uh, London North Western Railway livery, which is kind of, kind of funny. But I believe when they made this route, Obviously on the middle of them are still uh, running this line, so it makes sense. I'm not too sure why the seats are red. I'm pretty sure there is an, um, what do you call it? Passenger view update where they change the seats to green color. Because clearly this is for Southwestern Railway. The red color. Whereas London over Sin Railway is green, quite clearly. It's a bit faster. It's quite smooth actually. Because normally the wind, the weather's like this much, it's kind of laggy, but it's actually pretty smooth. So we've got seven and a half miles towards Long Buckby, and I believe, uh, where is it? I don't think it's going to show on this route, unfortunately, how far uh, rugby is, but that's okay. I'm sure it's only probably like, maybe another 10 miles away.
We are going slightly down also, we might pick up some pace. Put a little bit of brake in. So a few of you have been requesting me to do certain scenarios with certain trains and routes but uh, like I mentioned uh, you do need to link me the scenario so I can actually play it. I can't really, uh, I don't really have the time to actually go and look for the scenario for it because I've done hundreds and hundreds of train simulator videos and I, I'll be honest I'm not too sure which ones I've done and which ones I haven't done so so if you do find me the link of the scenario you want me to play then I can obviously check if I've actually done it myself already on the channel and then if I haven't then obviously I can do a video on it. So that will be the easiest way for me. Don't just say uh, do a video with the 387, link me a scenario for the 387. Or if you want me to do a scenario on the London to Brighton route then link me a scenario for that route or something like that. I've got just five miles left to Long Buckby. Just about the speed limit, so let's just get under 75. Missed that opportunity to take a nice screenshot there, but oh well. Let's actually check if there's any other trains coming our way. So that train's going to Euston clearly from Manchester Piccadilly. Got another Manchester Piccadilly to London Euston service. So a chance of taking a screenshot there. It's just passing Long Buckley now and we are all the way there so I think we've got a bit of time so that train passes us. soon. Get our screenshot ready, but why not? Then we'll get off the call anyway because we're coming up to words. Approaching Long Buckby, change it for other Northwestern Railway services. Now, 
Ho Ching Long Bok B. Probably one of the coolest names for station. I really like the name Long Bok B. And obviously the one, the station following it is called Rugby, so it does kind of make quite similar names. Sort of slowing down, kind of early, I think. Please mind a step between the train and the platform. platform just about fits an A car train so such a nice screenshot it's a bit of a curve actually this platform oops that's the wrong one We have another 350 passing by. We got a vending machine, a ticket machine, long buck bee, waiting room here, waiting shelter, I guess. But this train is ready to depart. Please, mind the doors. The next station is Rugby. Too sure why the horns aren't working. Might have to do the in cab. <laughs> yeah, just under 10 miles to go to the rugby. So just on the 
I know we're seven miles to go to the rugby. The weather seems to be staying the same. ETA is coming down slowly so should be good. Fifty mile hour speed limit just before we pro rugby, so we'll slow down just before that fifty uh, mile hour limit. And then we have a forty mile hour. Now, uh, 40 mile an hour speed limit. So, obviously, once we get to rugby, there's like two different lines one that goes towards um, towards um, Birmingham New Street, and one that goes straight towards Stafford and Crew. So, let's start slowing actually. Obviously, we're going to be going straight on towards uh, Stafford and Crew. Not us today, but you know. And I believe those tracks there would be going towards Bobby New Street on the left hand side. If you want to see a full journey from London Newton to Bobby New Street in the 390 Pendolino, then check my video out on the playlist, which should be linked in the description. Where I essentially drive from Newton all the way to Bobby New Street non stop in a 390 which was kind of really really cool did take a while but obviously um it's quite a long journey I think 115 to 20 miles so pretty long so if we were going towards Birmingham New Street we would have switched tracks there
The entrance to Rugby is actually really, really cool. And then you've got these high, pla uh, high tracks and then you've got the low tracks down there, so... Really, really cool. As we are now approaching Rugby, please change air flow services towards, I guess, Birmingham New Street. And towards Manchester Piccadilly and other destinations. We're actually really early, like a whole minute early, which is kind of amazing. I'm not. Where's this eight car marker anyway? Um. Oops, that's okay. I think we passed the eight car marker, but so let's stop here. This is rugby. Will be held here for a short while while we change drivers. Since I'm not going to be driving the remainder parts of the journey. And then the Virgin train services coming into Rugby Station, probably doing a service towards Birmingham New Street. Liverpool Lion Treat. It'll tell us on the anyway, so we'll check that. That is going to. Oh, that's a Wolverhampton to London Euston service. Oh, that's going to London Euston. Great work, driver. Scenario complete by Cranky Bots. Thank you very much. Scenario complete. We were speeding once at the beginning, which was completely my fault. But yeah, uh, hopefully, you guys enjoyed that one. If you did, give it a like, share it with your friends, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.